and Manu sir, you are my college teacher. I am teaching math since last 30 years. We are teaching same uh, ratio and proportion. Now this is another part of second lesson. Here three types of sum is given. First type of sum what is x by a, y by b, j by c, like this something is given. You have to prove something. This is the first type. What is the second type? A, B, C, D are proportion or E, F, whatever. This proportion, you have to prove something equal to something. Second part. Third part, what is A, B, C is continuous proportion. Or A, B, C, D continuous proportion. You have to prove something. There are three types of sums. So generally four sums I will do. And these four sums, this, chapter, this particular part is covered. More sums is given in the book. You have to practice from there. If any doubt is there, please write in the comment box. Then, uh, if you have any doubt, that I will explain you again in doubt clearing classes. I told you when 2000 subscriber is there, I will start live teaching. So please, student, do fast and spread it out so that you will do live class during the board exam. I expected within six months it, it has to be, and that is your responsibility. You have to come to that position. Okay, children. Now this is given. I have to write here x by a, y by b. J by C is given. J by C. Okay. Equal to say K. That is K I have taken. Okay. What I have taken? I have taken as K. Okay. X by A, Y by B, J by C equal to K. Okay, children. Now this from here, I will say, say K. Now from here, what I can do? X by A equal to K is given. Then what is x equal to children? x by a equal to k means x equal to ak. Okay, x by a equal to k, so x equal to ak. Similarly, I can say y equal to pk and z equal to cd. Clear? This I have got. But now using this, we have to prove this is equal to this. Now the first I write LHS part. LHS. What is given in LHS? x cube by a square y cube by b square and z cube by c square. Okay, now see here, x equal to what is? a k. So a k q write down. Here write a square. y equal to what is children? b k q. Here write b square. And z equal to c k q c square. Clear? Just I place the value of x y z from here, here. Then you have to solve this. How? What is coming here? a q a q by a square b q k q by b square c q k q by c square now this is cancel a here cancel b here this is cancel c here now k q take common what is left a plus b plus c so what i have got k q in bracket a plus b plus c the same thing i have to get from the right right hand side then both are equal. So I have to do RHS now. Okay, children, RHS. RHS what is given? X plus Y plus Z whole Q by A plus B plus C whole square. Okay, now X equal to what is children? X equal to AK. Right here AK. This is BK and this is CK. By it is whole Q is given and this is given A plus B plus C whole square. Okay, from here what is common? Common is k, but remember whole q is given. So when I take k is common, then kq should be there. So write down kq, this q comes on that also. Now a plus b plus c whole q by a plus b plus c whole square. Okay, now a plus b plus c whole q, a plus b plus c whole square, this I have to cancel this what is left here left a plus b plus c because it is given three times it is given two times so one time left then what is coming here coming k q a plus b plus c now see children whatever i have got here there i have got same thing that means lhs equal to rhs so what i say left hand side equal to right hand side then i say proved this way you have to do this type of sum now we have to do one more new type of sum. So please copy this. I am coming for the next part. Now see the second sum, the next sum, what is given? It is a little different than previous one. Here what is they have said 
ABCD are in proportion. ABCD are in proportion, not continuous proportion, only proportion. Prove that this one, this is to this, equal to this is to this. Now that one something is given x by a y or what is y by b like that it is given. Here a, b, c, d are proportion. Proportions means already I know a is to b, c is to d. This one already I know, you know that when proportion is there I can write like this. That means I can say a by b equal to c by d equal to k, c, okay. This is given a by b, c by d equal to k. Now from here I have to prove that one. So here a by b equal to k. So what I can say a equal to bk and c equal to what I can say dk. Nothing else I can do. Using this, we have to prove this one. Same way LHS equal to RHS. First write LHS, the left hand side first I will do. What is given left hand side? What is given? A4 plus C4 by B4 plus D4. Okay children, is to given? Is to means by. Now A4 I have to place. A means what? BK square. BK. So BK4 I have to write down. Plus C means what? DK. So DK4 write down. Here given B4, here given D4. Now B4, K4, D4, K4. B4, D4. Now K4 is common. B4 plus D4. And down what is children? It is less space. So try to understand it. This is cancelled. Okay. Now what is left? Equal to K4 is coming. Equal to K4 is coming. That means from LHS. I have got K4. That means from RHS also I have to get K4. Then both should come equal. Then I can say LHS equal to RHS. What is given RHS? RHS is so simple it is given. A square C square by B square and D square. Okay. So small it is given. Just place the value of A and C. A what is still in? A is BK. So whole square is given. And C means DK. Whole square write down. And what is given? B square and D square. Okay, now see, if I say B square and K square, I can say, and B square and K square, I can say, here B square and D square, B square and D square. Now, this is cancelled with this, this is cancelled with this. Now, K square into K square, what is coming? That is coming K4. Okay, students, now see K4 here coming, and K4 is coming there. So, both are equal. So, what I can say, LHS equal to RHS. Proved. So this way we can prove. So two sums I have, do, two I have done already and the two more sums is there. Two different sums are there. One I said about continuing proportion and one little different types that I will do in the next video. So please continue seeing the videos and study well all children which are depend on you. If you study well, you will have a good marks, you have a good career in your life. If you won't study, then you have to suffer it. So please Study very well, see the videos, spread it out, share this video to all of your friends. Okay, goodbye children.